this brief account are this is a brief account about how uh, Gaulus Caesar was killed. We're talking about the uh, the elder brother of Emperor Julian. Now, Constantius, a cousin, uh, was now master of the entire empire, uh, ruling with just a single junior colleague. Now, these, this was Gaulus Caesar, the older of the two nephews of Constantine to survive the bloodletting in 337. Um, he and his half-brother Julian were raised in virtual captivity and were not given any public role or responsibilities to prepare them for high office. Now, the 26-year-old Gaulus was appointed Caesar in 351 AD. Um, now, both of uh, Constantius' brothers were killed. Uh, um, Constantine and Constans and his half-brother his half brother Crispus was killed, um, the cousins uh, Hannibalius and Dalmatius, and another cousin uh, Apotianus, and all these people were killed. And all the usurpers were also killed uh, Magnantius, the Gentius, Silvanus, and so forth. Um, uh, so he was appointed to Caesar and he was left to supersede the eastern provinces while Constantius went off to deal with Magnantius, the great usurper. Uh, at first, he seemed to have performed his task reasonably complete, uh, completely, but mistrust was surely inevitable between a Caesar and the Augustus who had murdered his father and relatives. It was no coincidence that the friction came to a head just as Constantius was finishing the process of mopping up rebellion in Gaul. Uh, Gaulus may have become less restrained in his behaviour, and certainly his relations with many of the senior officials appointed by the Augustus had become tense. Um, he had also made himself unpopular with the wealthy families of Antioch, blaming them for deliberately creating a great shortage in the city so that they could force prices up. A number of prominent men were arrested, tortured and killed on trumped up charges. One governor was torn to pieces when Gaulus handed them over to an angry mob in Antioch. So more or less this meant a rebellion against um, Constantius. Castanius moved cautiously, fearing that his Caesar, Gaulus, would win enough local support to rise against him. Now, gradually, Gaulus was stripped of the military forces at his immediate disposal, and then in 354 uh, uh, AD, he was summoned to join the Augustus in northern Italy, ostensibly for a celebration. On the way, he was arrested and executed. An officer then rode to Milan, that's Medio Lano, Milan, as fast as the relays of horses from the Imperial Post Service could carry him, and there he threw the Caesar's jeweled encrusted imperial shoes down before a delighted uh, Constantius, as if they were the spoils taken from a dead Parthian king. Uh, and so that's how Julian came to power later on, and he led the final uh, usurpation. Um, against his cousin Constantius. Uh, so we see troubled times. We see two brothers, uh, Constantine and Constans, being killed. The nephews, um, Hannibalius and, um, and uh, Dalmatius being killed. We see the father of Julian and, and, and um, Gaulus being killed. And Gaulus revolting in his way, his own way. Uh, and the only two survivors of the, of the Constantine dynasty being Constantius and Julian himself, who would take control after the death of Constantius. So anyway, so this was a really brief account about the death of um, Gaulus Caesar in 354 uh, AD, not long after the death of the usurper Magnentius.